So I thought I'd try and tell the story of Cookie. And everyone wants to know Cookie's story, so let's start. Um, about four years ago, when the World Parrot Refuge closed down, that's where Coco and Lucky Lou and Floyd were from. Um, when they closed down, uh, it was kind of like all hands on deck for all the people who own parrots. So everyone um, pitched in to help if they could. So before the actual birds were removed, I contacted my vet and asked if she needed me to foster any of the birds in the in the clinic because she needed to make room for all the um, incoming birds from the refuge. Anyway, so I get an email uh, from the the clinic manager. And she says, oh, we have two lovely Amazons here. Um, perhaps you could foster them. One's name is Sid. His name is spelled S-I-D. And the other's name is Cujo. And his name was spelled C-O-O-J-O. So I wasn't even thinking, like, connecting the names to anything. And so I said, sure, I'll take them both. I don't mind. And then um, after I'd had them a while, I realized that Cujo stood for Cujo, the killer dog, and Sid was Sid Vicious. So they were both really aggressive Amazons, and I'd never dealt with an Amazon before. And their body language is so different. Like when they get all lit up and flash their eyes and their feathers go um, fluffy, that... That means they're excited and they want to kill you. I thought it meant that they were happy. Anyway, so that so that was the funny part of the story is that um, I thought I was getting um, cute Amazons. Anyways, so I had these, I had Sid and Cujo and then um, Lucky and Coco came. We just got the house, so I had lots of room, and I had only had three birds, so I was like, okay, I can open my home up to more birds now that there's more room in the house. And so Cookie or Cujo and Sid were here, and then Coco and Lucky came, and then I didn't really say much about the Amazons. Everyone wanted to see the birds, wanted to see Coco and Lucky Lou, so I didn't want people to think I had too many birds because at that point I had five. So I would call them the secret birds. So Cujo and Sid were called the secret birds. And then on social media, everyone was like, well, who are the secret birds? And I'm like, I'm not saying. Because <laughs> they were just fosters. I wasn't keeping them. And so <clears throat> Cujo and Sid were, would gang up on me. Like they'd take over the whole bird room. And they wouldn't let me in. Like if they were out together, they were they were just awful. They were like big bullies and they Sid was really bad he'd fly at your face and try and bite your face off 